This is Twit. In between shows, Sal showed me something I had never seen on Mac OS that blew my mind. Uh, this is uh, from uh, a site that uh, he has that is uh, something everybody who uses Macintosh should absolutely bookmark. It's called dictationcommand.com. Commands.com. And we're going to show you a little demo that Apple has never shown. No one has ever shown. This is straight out of the year 2020. And we've been able to do this for years on the Macintosh, and no one knows. Watch this. I have this belief that the computer should serve you. Yes. Right? Crazy man. Why do we have, for accessibility, why do we have people scraping the screen, go looking at this button and stuff? Know, why know. The computer knows everything. Why can't I just ask the computer? This is an example of me using the dictation commands of Mac OS X yeah. built in. Yeah. To have that computer tell me everything about a presentation and give it to me and deliver it. So let me go back again. Yeah. We're going to hear Sal ask what it, for what he wants. Right. Open document. This is the document. Tell me about this presentation. The current document, named Bright Future, is not playing. Its dimensions are 1920 by 1080 and is based on the gradient theme. It has six slides, of which two slides are skipped. The current slide is slide number one, and slide numbers are not showing. The document has been previously saved. Tell me about this slide. The current slide is slide number one. Its master slide is photo, horizontal. A transition effect has been applied. The default slide title is showing. The default slide body is showing. And the slide has no presenter notes. Tell me about the transition of this slide. The current slide transition effect is set to dissolve. It is started on click and the transition duration is 1.5 seconds. Start from the top. So, Read the slide. Bright future. Hear the tone? Yeah. The growth of renewable energy production in California. A close-up image of a solar panel displaying a girt of squares containing vertical sections of blue photovoltaic material. Read the next slide. Slide two of four. Bright future. The percentage of energy generated in California by renewable technologies is greater than coal, hydroelectric, nuclear, and oil combined. A graphic showing that the amount of energy in California generated by renewable technologies is only surpassed by natural gas. Stop this presentation. So what are you hooking into here? Because that, that's you Apple can't do script. that right it's now. It's an Apple script library. It's a, Oops, it's, it's, like, it's like an 800K file. It's just an Apple script that has routines that when I ask a question, it gets the dictation architecture says, okay, that matches this command, and it goes to the library and executes that command. So when I say, tell me about this. Do you have the script this, anywhere I can look at it? Yeah. So, this, so the script can get from the dictation. It can get the text the or. The dictation can call the commands in the script library. Okay. This is built into every Mac. It's been there for 15 I gotta, years. I really got to look at this. Right? Okay. So I could, I, then do I have to turn on, what do I have to be doing? Running that script? No. All you have to do is turn on dictation. So I press function key twice. Yeah. And I give it a command, and how does it know to run the script? It matches that. That command is matched to that library. But 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 but. but, 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 but so but, <laughs> this is what it should. This is what the computer is capable of doing. And not only did I have it tell me about it, I had started telling it turn on, go to the first slide. Yeah. And I'm saying... And that's that. all Keynote Dictionary yeah, OSA. That was, that's what happens when you take a scriptable app like Keynote. Right. You put you can create give it an commands. Apple script library. Yeah. And now you can Tell it have, to do stuff. 
So, uh, and then it sends that. What's cool is it sends it back to the voice. Yeah. Okay. This is my website for this. Okay. Right. So scroll up. So you could. This is fascinating. Yeah. I didn't know you this could video do this. right there. I didn't know you could do this. This has been there for 15 years. No one Leo. knows this. <laughs> you know it. Now, Here we go. Why, this is what's possible. Switch to photos. This is live. This is me Select doing this. All photos. Help me to add titles. Enter the title for image one of five. Wow. This would be a great accessibility feature. F or just five. usefulness. Or just useful, yeah. Yeah. So. Does anybody use Three this? of five. Yes. People are doing this. Yes. All right, I'm going to have to. This show. is the, dicta this the dictation break. architecture on Mac OS is incredibly powerful. And you don't have to say a particular phrase. It can understand 30 of variations of five what you five. say. It doesn't have to match the code. It does exactly. not have to match. Wow. wow. Done. All right, now watch this. Select all photos. Make a new presentation with these. Oh, wow. Look at that. <laughs> Why not? Why not? The computer knows what, it to, knows do. what to do. Go to slide one. Change master slide to title center. Edit slide title. Ready. Vacation photos. Now, do you uh, put the sounds in in the select script? photos? No, it does it automatically. That's the OS. The OS capitalize does it. Yeah. that. I have to show this on MacBreak. I just stop edit. I just dictated that, capitalized it. So great. Move this slide to the end. Done. You can control. Now, Watch you're this. clicking, but the dictation is still photos. open, right? I left it running. So you just leave it running? Yeah. So I just asked to edit that photo right. back in photos. Right. It, it knows the photo. It showed it to me. Right. So I'm going to go in here, edit out the background crap, and make that tighter. It's such so, a set of hands. Yeah, yeah. That's really neat. So it's, and you keep it, that running, which I like it, so you can do kind of a mixed operation. Yeah. So I have it. You can have it set for a variety of ways. You can have it set for only works when you press a key, right. or it has a keyword like computer. Right. But I just have it open running because I'm work sitting here in my office and I'm working. Right. Show this in Keynote. That's it, so. Sweet. It knows where it is. Now I'm going to select it and say update it. Oh wow! Update this image. Oh wow! That's fantastic. So it goes back to photos, does an export, imports it. Watch this. So I have an Show image this here. In maps. So I'm going to go to the Maps app. It's going to take what? me to that image. No. Then I'm going to do a 3D view of it. That's the Pope's Palace in RLA, I right? Know. Yeah. We saw it too last yeah. year. Were you just there? So, okay, now I'm going to take this and say, put this over there. Export this map to Keynote. Oh, man. That's awesome. These are the kind of things that the computer could should be should doing. Do. Yes. I should, I should, you know, I'm still doing the stuff by hand. I'm still working, yeah. but it's doing the grunt work right. of import, right. export, right. grabbing this, right. doing this. Right. Which is, frankly, it's doing much faster than you would do because you'd have to dig through yeah. stuff. And yeah, yeah. Yeah, DictationCommands.com. We're gonna. I'm gonna show this on Tuesday on Mac Break Weekly and tell Apply everybody. Apply a magic move. Yeah, tell everybody about it. That's really awesome. Apply a dissolve. So. Oh my God. You know what it's like trying Do to set up again. a transition. Pain in the ass. Oh, we Watch this. Too. Do that again. It knows what you oh, just did. So much Do easier. Again. Oh my God. Now watch this one. So here I have an image that's wide. Scale this to fit slide width. <laughs> now watch. Make a long panoramic sequence. Done. <laughs> Done. Put descriptions on top of every image. This is like futuristic. This ha this is. Today, search spotlight. I'm doing this live. If you, this is in like France. you do this in a sci-fi movie. 
Zoom, enhance, center. Open result. So I just did a system search, found that. Select the table. Select the table. Now watch this. Export this table to Keynote as a chart. Oh, my God. <laughs> this is so much faster than doing it by hand. Yeah. This is now, what the... you happen to know by heart because you wrote it, the Keynote Start Dictionary. Start from the top. Which helps. Yeah. But, I mean, the first you can create... How long does it take to create standard things oh, that you do? Oh, it's a pain in the butt. Yeah. So it's worth learning this. Put those in a library right. of standard commands and attach them to a voice. Look at that. Oh, this is the panel I created. Oh, yeah. that's really cool. I didn't even know Keynote could do that. <laughs> you try doing it by that's hand, you awesome. can't. But oh, if you automate it, you can do it. Oh, my God. When were you there? This was... This was the oh, last. This cruise. this was okay. uh, down the Rhone River Geek Cruise. Yeah, we did a we did a river cruise. We did this river cruise. Yeah. So um, I didn't know he was doing river cruises. He did a couple. This was like oh, I missed those. Yeah, this Too is bad. like the last. So then it goes back out again. And then remember the one I did with the magic move. Yeah. So then I select this. Look at that. It scales down. It shows oh, you the my place. God. Look at that. So now watch this. Now I've Save done this presentation. So it saves it. And the thing is, you, hold you on, hold on. save this presentation to my thumb drive and eject it. Saving document vacation photos to drive digital briefcase. Nice. Dismounting digital briefcase. Wow. Done. 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 So, what else do you need? I just saved it. Yeah. Scratch that. So I made a mistake. I said scratch that. It undoes. Add a blank slide. So now I'm going to add a piece of text. To it. I'm going to add a URL to dictation commands there on this. Okay, dictation right. commands. Now watch this. This will, this is the topping. So, you know, people do video, so you want to... Turn this into a QR code. Ah! Scale down 10%. Scale down 10%. <laughs> so this, I have a library of 400 commands for iWork and the Finder and photos that you can install from dictation commands. And you can do this demo yourself. Oh, my God. This is what's possible on the computer with automation when you combine automation and just dictation. This is wow. not Siri. We're not looking at Siri here. This is not, you know, uh, natural language interpolated server stuff. This is just it's already, useful stuff. It's been stuff. there for years. Yeah, it's been there for, you could have done this 10 years ago.